The COVID-19 pandemic has been hard on small businesses, but Cronkite News reporter Tyler Mannion went inside a local staple to find out about a different type of struggle the coronavirus has caused. Film bar is a unique combination of exactly what you'd expect, a place to view films and a bar. But when I went to get the story of yet another business that struggled through COVID, what I found here was different and deeper than what I've heard before. The reels started rolling at Film Bar in downtown Phoenix 10 years ago. Since, it's been called a cultural epicenter for the city. Owner Kelly Aubie created a place that reminds people of home. It's a little bit like going to see a film in a really uh, interesting living room with, you know, 75 of your best friends. But COVID-related health precautions made that impossible. And Film Bar was like the 62% of businesses that saw a loss of revenue nationwide. Our numbers are down 90% or greater. I'll be considered turning out the lights for good. A decision had to be made. And while the comfortable business plan was this indoor seating arrangement, now all of these seats would be empty. So we had to adapt and did so by changing locations. The solution was to make an outdoor theater with, yes, a huge screen and slightly different chairs. But the emotional toll the pandemic took was strong. I've always kind of thought of myself as somebody who I was pretty good at managing his, his feelings about stuff and kind of a strong guy and can move forward. Uh, but there have been long periods of time where I'm not sure I have left anything left. This constant struggle is the less discussed side of COVID-19's impact on small business. In many ways, it was the straw that almost broke this entrepreneur's back. I just didn't see a way forward. And it didn't at the moment feel as sad as you might think. I was so tired and beat up at that point that it kind of felt like a relief that I could admit to myself that it was time to move on from this. But then came a surge of support on social media with hundreds of people commenting, sharing, and most importantly donating, Aubie had no choice. And going from stale popcorn on the floor of an abandoned theater to this would help start to swing those emotions. So would success at the new location. To see a full house again, and people that are ready to see this production. Uh, and I addressed the crowd when I walked up. I mean, it, it almost brought a tear to my eye because it was like, there they are, you know? Not there they are because, hey, maybe my business is gonna make it, but there they are because they're getting out. Now, it's back to the mission of bringing people together through film. Selling a few drinks and showing films again are the important first steps. Because while movies unite a community, Enjoy the show. Thank you. so do small businesses. Filmbar has applied for the SVG grant, which would award them 45% of gross revenue from 2019 and save the business. If they don't get it, though, Aubie will be faced with yet another tough decision. In the studio, Tyler Mannion, Cronkite News.